Well, it's 9.30 on Monday. And let's see, we were up, waking up on a floating island, on a, spent two and a half hour, or three hours on a boat, and then climbed a mountain, and then got on a plane from, from uh, Puno to now we're in Lima. Juliaca. To, oh, yeah, yeah. To, to Yaka. And then uh, flew out of um, Puno. So at any rate, uh, now we're in Lima. We're going to head, I guess, to a hotel and then a bus to somewhere else. So, here we go. Well, we got three hours of sleep. And we are off to where, hun? Where are we going? Uh, Nazca. Nazca. Paracas. Paracas. And Bracas. Paracas. So it's 3 a.m. in the morning here. And we got about two and a half hours of sleep because um, we had to take a plane to get to here. We're in Lima, so now we're going to take a three-hour bus ride um, and then um, also a plane over the NASCAR drawings. So we are on our way from Peru. Here we go, getting on the bus. It's uh, seven. We're off the bus. Paracas. Or yes. Paracas now. Paracas. So. Getting ready to board the boat. Um, for the two hour ride. I caked on sunscreen because we're gonna be in the, out in the water for the next two hours. I wanna stop behind a red mountain. There is a enigmatic line, cactus, or chandelier, similar to Nazca lines. We'll stop there. After that, to Ballestas Islands. Mountain a few kilometers was discovered underground houses, underground cities, and mummies. Paracas culture developed since 700 before Christ until 300 after Christ. The island looks like it's painted, but it's actually covered with birds. So amazing, it's like a bird city. Total bird city. It's wild. But over here is the sea lion city coming up.
Bueno. These ones were, uh, weren't so successful in mating, so they got hurt in fighting. So this is the recovery room area where they recover for up to three weeks from fighting um, because it's mating season right now, which is where that big area was that we saw with all the sea lions. They were, that was the mating area, and then obviously there were a bunch of babies around there too. So these are the guys that weren't so successful over here. He's way in the back. Wow. Look at the baby. So the each each particular seal will have four to ten uh, females around him, and then he'll have his kids. They'll have like one one baby per per female. So, but one male will have four to ten females and then of course they'll have their their babies they're feeding right now too you might wonder what the uh, sea lions eat they actually eat octopus crab birds fish pelicans pelicans every, everything, everything anything they want and um, what do you call it as far as you know safety um, the divers that have been around here there's never been any incidents but the uh, sea lions actually brush up against the divers um, like very friendly in the water and when you go um, outside of the water on the land they all stay away from you there was an accident about uh, a couple years ago where one of those boats um, landed on the uh, island and all the sea lions went to one side and in the water and um, what do you call it for six months they never returned to that spot where the uh, boat was so, they had the memory of, uh, of the accident. Yeah, so they're actually pretty smart. Um, yeah. But um, pretty. They're like dogs. Like dogs, yeah. yeah. Pretty cool, though. Beautiful animals. their habitat right it's so cool not like a zoo but actually yeah. like where we're a guest checking them out that's yeah. it's just very cool that natural habitat very cool